Hi guys, how are you? I hope you guys are all doing well. So today I am so excited because today you guys went in and asked me some really, really, really scary um, assumptions. So today I'm going to be doing the fire assumption questions. Now I'm going to be putting a timer on. I've got Adol here to my left. He's got a timer. He's going to put the timer on. You guys probably would have seen this video flying about on YouTube because everyone everyone's doing it right now and a lot of you guys wanted me to do this so I'm so nervous I'm a bit excited um, but more than anything I'm nervous to see what you guys have asked me now I have not seen these questions adults just screenshot it and he's got it on my phone so I have not read through any of these questions I promise you so without this long intro um, you ready? You got the yep. timer on? Let's go. Three, two, one, ten minutes. Let's go. Oh. Right, if you could go back, you might have chosen a slightly different career. I, no, I would definitely do the career that I'm doing right now. I absolutely love it. With all my heart and soul, I would 100% do this career. You starve yourself to lose weight? I do not starve myself, no. I love food. And food is literally life. You only want two children. I no, I just want one kid actually. <laughs> you and your sister Maria look so so much alike. A lot of people say that, but I don't see it. Do you see it? No, I think you look more like your man. Yeah, I I don't see it, but people do people do say that I do. Okay, yeah. cool. Um, that you you like expensive things and love to shop designer. Yes, mm -hmm. a hundred. <laughs> mm -hmm. And on the background, like mm -hmm. yes, you do. Um, yes. You like going out a lot, and not staying indoors. Um, that's actually incorrect. I actually enjoy staying in. Like, yeah, but we do go out a lot. More. We do go out a lot. Um, obviously to stay fit and get our steps in, etc. Now that we're in lockdown, but I am a home kind of girl. So if we had to choose, Adol knows this. If we had to choose between going out for like a meal out or having it in, watching a movie, I'd be an in kind of girl. What is your favorite restaurant and why? <sighs> restaurant right now, I would say probably Connor. More than Tipper? I'd say, hmm, this is a tricky question because I don't really eat out as much as a like compared to before. Like we don't eat out much anymore. I don't know. This is a really hard one. If I had to choose one, because I know the time's going, eight I, minutes left. I, I would choose, let's say, Tipper Sultan. Okay, cool. It's like an Indian cuisine. Oh, um, it's Indian cuisine, and I love Indian food. Um, I would say because I've got options, I've got vegetarian options. So I would say that the cat's cool. just going crazy. <laughs> this one's a funny one. You have six figures in your bank account. <laughs> six For figures. For security reasons, I am not going to give that away. <laughs> but you never know. Maybe, maybe <laughs> not. But I will not be giving any of that information away. On, in, in this, is, this is a good one. You're not going to be a fallen hijabi. Meaning you're not going to take, take your hijab, hijab off. You are very correct. Inshallah, if God is there watching over me, God keeps me on the straight path, inshallah. I will not take off my hijab. Never, ever, ever. <laughs> um, I assume you don't want to have a baby now in your life. I hope you don't mind me assuming that. Why would you assume that? No, I wasn't. Okay. Um, you're going to have a baby soon. That's what it says. Allahu Yalim. Only God knows if I'm going to have a kid soon. When are you coming to Dubai? I need to meet you. I love oh my you so god, much. so funny because I don't know, I don't want to keep on talking about it. But me and Adam, literally, I swear to God, half an hour ago, we we're literally talking about Dubai and how much yeah. we really want to go back to Dubai as soon as. So we will let you know. We will we let you do. know, but it is definitely on the agenda. That's one of the first places we want to go after lockdown, inshallah, is Dubai, isn't it? Yep, yep. Um, Lots of kid questions. Lots of baby questions. I always seem to get a lot of baby questions okay. and assumptions. About kids. What the? Iman is your favorite sister. That's what she wrote. She wrote, yeah. She wrote that. Cheeky. We'll have to see about that. <laughs> uh, you're close to your sisters. Um, yeah, to some extent. You don't okay, like no. cooking? Um, no, that's incorrect. I actually enjoy cooking. Um, I've started to enjoy cooking. I'll be honest. When I first started, when I first got married, I didn't enjoy cooking at all. 
but I am starting to creep into like I'm starting to enjoy cooking I would say especially now that we're in lockdown me and Alan's been cooking a lot of different recipes um, and trying different things out we actually have a second channel where we actually have filmed a few recipes for you guys which we will be updating really soon but yeah I'll leave that link down below for you guys I'm gonna stop rambling going on to next question <laughs> You've grown your eyebrows out and they look banging natural. Yes! Love that, babes. Yes, I have I have been growing out my eyebrows. Um only of course, first and foremost, because of religion reasons, religious reasons, we're not supposed to really do our eyebrows as such. Um we're only supposed to do the middle bit. So yeah, I do not touch my eyebrows. My eyebrows are natural. Obviously now I've got makeup on, I've filled Five it. Five minutes, your full time job is YouTube. Yes. You Oh, that's incorrect. Well, it is my full time job is YouTube, but I have my side business. You've got a couple of things. Um, it? I've got my side business, which I um, I'm a lash technician, guys. If you guys don't know that, it's been one year since I've been <laughs> lashing, which makes me so like so proud of myself. But yeah, you don't embrace your adult's culture. He seems more adaptable. That's an interesting question. Meaning you don't embrace my side of the thing. In what culture? sense? Because I don't get that question. Because if it means like I don't adapt in terms of like I don't eat what he eats, that's very incorrect. Maybe as in like culture as in... Like what though? I don't wear Asian clothes? Yeah, maybe that side or family uh, side, maybe, I don't know. I don't know what you mean by that, but if you mean like... I do eat, we eat a lot of Asian food in our household. We both enjoy like spicy food and stuff like that. But if you mean like wearing Asian clothes like on a regular basis, no I don't. If that's what you mean, but I don't know what you mean, so. You think you should have more views on YouTube? Yes, 100%. <laughs> yes. I, you get works hit hard out here, yeah? So, of course, like, you would always wish you have more, but you know what? I'm happy with what I have, alhamdulillah. I'm yeah. always going to keep it going. Quick, oh, quick, four okay, minutes. Okay, okay, you okay. want to move out of Leicester? Um, yeah, I want to move to Dubai. <laughs> You're struggling to conceive? Again, Allahu Yalam, I don't know. Only Allah knows. Okay. Um, so many kid questions. You guys are like really into, interested in our... You have a small circle of friends that like to keep yourself to yourself, like me, ha? Huh? Yes, 100%. Uh, I used to have a lot of friends back in uni, in college, and a lot of friends. But um, throughout the years, my friend group has gotten a lot smaller. And I have chose it to be that way because of a lot of other stuff that happened in the past, but we're not gonna go into that. We've you got... are confident in the way you look and dress, by the way, I love you. I am confident. Yeah. Um, to, to some extent, some days I wake up and I'm so confident, I love myself and I embrace me, but sometimes I wake up and I'm having literally the worst day ever. I'm very insecure about how I look, about my weight. So there's days, there's days where I feel good and there's days where I feel bad, so 50-50. You pout hard in your videos and pictures. I don't know how these are assumptions, but yeah. <laughs> no, I don't pout. If I do a pout, it's not me doing it. It's just, it just happens, like, I guess. But I, I don't do it on purpose. You don't see me just like, no. You and I will get along more now that you did when you were newly married. Yes, 100%. That is a true assumption. Okay. Do you agree? Okay. Yeah, yeah. You like your body size, weight. Why is everything about weight? I don't know. Is um, it that or? Um, um, that's a, that's a tricky question. Again, I do have good days and I have bad days, but I am a lot, I would say even you could agree with that. I guess I'm a lot more confident now than what I was, let's say two years ago, because I've worked hard to get to where I am, okay? <laughs> you have considered getting lip fillers done in the past? Mm, yes, that's true, I have. I have considered it. Um... I already said that you only want two children, innit? Uh, no, I didn't say that. Yeah, you did. I want two kids. That's you only want two children. That's the assumption we did that. Oh, yeah, we did that. Yeah. Um, Come on, time sticking. You never want to leave the UK or move out somewhere and live somewhere else in the, uh, I do outside wanna, the UK. I do want to live. I do want to move out. <laughs> Sorry, I do want to live. What's your favourite destination and why? Um, Favourite destination that I haven't been to is I want to go to Bali and I definitely want to go to Mamres. Um, Mamres? What's that place I want to go to? Antalya. Anta no, not Antalya. The one with the beach and stuff like that. Where uh, is it? Which country? I don't know. But I would say Bali. I want to go to Bali, but um, it looks amazing, but I haven't been there. But if you're talking about a place I have been, my favorite place yet is Dubai because Dubai is hands down the best place ever. 
What's your favorite drink and why? Hot, cold. Either. Hot and cold. Okay, if it's hot, of course you guys know it's coffee. Coffee's life. Um, if it's cold, I would say... Um, Mountain Dew. No, I'd say, I was going to say Rubicon Mango. Really? Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. All right. All right. I, I've actually stopped having a lot of fizzy drinks. I'm more... I'm having like more healthier options. I used to quick, quick, 39 it. seconds. Okay, last one is what I was gonna say. I was gonna say, if you won a lottery, a million pounds, what was the first thing you would do? I would buy, I would I would give some money to the poor, first and foremost, um, I contribute a large amount to the poor, and then I would buy a house. Um, would you ever want to get a dog? Yes. How many seconds do we have left? 15 seconds. If I could, yes, I'll get What's a dog. What's your favorite dog? I would get a um, a pug. A Why little, a pug? Because it's small and cute and it's it's adorable and I can just take it for walks and I can see me with that dog. Ah, three seconds, two seconds. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Done. Ten minutes. Is that ten minutes? Yeah. Wow, that went so fast. Ten minutes done. <gasps> okay, so that was that was actually really new racking. Like I'm, I think I'm sweating a little bit. Anyways, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you guys enjoyed it don't forget to smash that thumbs up and thank you Alo for being my little you know question mark man question mark question man <laughs> question, question mark my question man but yeah if you guys enjoyed it and you want to see a part two then do let me know down below and you can leave your questions or if you want to see me answer any assumptions you can oh. ask questions Ooh. to me that'd be interesting ask some assumptions to Adol. could be about us could be about a relationship could be about anything that'd be quite interesting but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did don't forget to smash that thumbs up i should love you and leave you